Moments ago, a, a cliff rescue unfolded with a man down several stories. He was unable to get back up onto the trail. Yeah, 10 News reporter Nate Holmes joins us live from near the cove in La Jolla. Nate, that's a place, an area where you got to be pretty careful sometimes. Absolutely. The f battalion chief tells me that this man was very lucky. They got the call just around 6.50 this morning. Now, you can actually see if we're zooming into the camera you can see the yellow tape there in the barricades are missing that's where the crews were working this morning now when help arrived the man was sitting on the ledge just down below just feet from above the water now the battalion chief tells me that they were able to use a rope method to pull the man up it took about an hour to get him up the cliff now the rescue team as well as lifeguards responded to the scene as standard protocol and all in all about 16 personnel responded here this morning now there are signs in this area asking people to stay back and the battalion chief tells us climbing on this cliff can be very dangerous because of the uh, the sandstone it's a little it's a little tricky because the, the footing slippery so these areas are all uh, well barricaded off and fenced off and uh, there's lots of warnings about the instability of the cliffs, so it's um, uh, people do this time to time. We really ask them to, to heed the warnings and the signs and not put themselves in these precarious positions. Now, the battalion chief tells me that the man was very lucky. This situation could have been worse, and he says, though, that the man walked away with no injuries. Again, crews are asking you to pay attention and adhere to those warning signs and not go behind those barricades here on the cliff. Live in La Jolla, Nate Holmes, 10 News.